what is going on guys i'm going to revisit the vvt solenoid one more time this time we're going to also pull up some rpms and timing advance to make a little more sense out of what's going on i have the ignition on so this is the uh, duty cycle going to the solenoid which means the system's on and i'm going to go ahead and crank it up and we'll uh see what we get So the engine is almost ice cold. I did run it for like two minutes, maybe 15 minutes ago, because I actually tried shooting this video and there was a couple of glitches and I really didn't want to waste you guys time. So here we can just see the, uh, what, the relationship between what's happening with the, you know, the timing advance. Although it's strange, the timing advance doesn't, there it goes. Now it's dropping a little bit, it's going up. It's kind of, I don't know what it's doing. It's all over the place. Um, RPMs are coming down. I would think that the duty cycle would come down to shift that cam, you know, to retard it. And um, again, but that's only while it's shifting it, right? When it's just in a steady state, when it's not moving, whatever position it's in, it's going to have basically that kind of waveform there, like a 40%, say between a 38 and a 44% duty cycle. Uh, RPMs are coming down. Timing advance is. I don't know, it's kind of a little bouncing around a little bit. I don't know if that's like a timing chain thing. Or I, th I think within one unit is okay. But that's pretty cool. You can kind of see everything happening there. I, I wanted to show you guys like, you know, the whole kit and caboodle in, in one shot. And it's still kind of doing its thing as it warms up, right? Thanks for checking it out, you guys.